Hello friend, welcome back to Totem Internet's YouTube channel. I will film this as an update and the ending on the 2009 Toyota RAV4 which was towed to my shop yesterday with no start conditions. Right? We diagnosed the problem was the battery. I couldn't finish the video because the battery to evaluate it needed a full charge overnight, right? Deep cycle charge. And it just happened. I just got to my shop. The battery I counted it was basically charged for 22 hours altogether. And I want to see the result. I couldn't sleep, right? I had a nightmares. Is it charged or is it not? Is that new charger working correctly or not? So let's go and see what's happening there. I'm really curious. And as I said, I just got to my shop, right? Open the blinds and here is the 2009 RAV4. And I really, really wonder if the battery is okay, right? You remember there's no stickers. I have no clue how old it is. What this new Duracell charger did with it. Wow, this is incredible. It actually says that it has a 12 volt. The charge level is not flashing anymore. All right, now you hopefully can see it in that spot. And that battery should be good. So, but I know you are paying attention. So you wanna see the test results, right? We have to test the battery. So the charger is disconnected. Where is my tester? Somewhere here. You are familiar with this top dome, right? And I will move the camcorder so you can observe perfectly the results. And obviously this will answer everything, right? That will be showing us what to do next. If I have to call the owner and say, hey, come to get the car, or I have to first call for the prices of the new battery then to call them and find out maybe they have uh, some warranty for it, who knows, right? So you know this stop down? I think you can see the screen, I will try my best. So it says, after immediately removing it from the charger, 13.26 volts, that will be dropping slowly, right? Now, select language, English. I'm trying to not do the glare on the display, so you can see it perfectly. Uh, out of the vehicle, yes, it's completely disconnected from the vehicle's cables, so that's considered out of vehicle. Before charge, no, 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 right after the charge. Boom, regular flooded, yes. CCA, right, that should be there from yesterday, there is 600 CCA, so I will just push OK and it will start testing. And let me try to zoom on it, okay. State of health, 61 percent state of charge 98 percent right so it might be charged yeah whatever it might have a voltage 13.24 volts but look it's only having available 490 amps right instead of 600 and internal resistance it's fairly high 6.08 milliohms this little battery charger says replace. Despite the fact you remember yesterday we were able even after only four and a half hours of charging is completely started the vehicle, right? It was running, everything was fine, the alternator was charging it. It doesn't matter. These testers are really important because they tell you the real truth. Yesterday somebody in the comments said, hey, did you put it on the load, right, tester? That's nice, right, but it will pass the load tester. If it has available 490 amps, it will pass the load tester easily. However, you will not get the info that the battery is bad internally and should be replaced. 
So now I will write down all these details, write this test result. There's no printer on it, it's simple. So I will write it down exactly. I might take a picture of it right on my camera and I will immediately call the owners and tell them what's happening and they can make decision what they want to do with it. But I will follow recommendation of the tester and say, hey, that should be replaced. Unless, and hopefully you guys have some receipt and the battery is maybe just two years old or something, and you can get a free replacement. Well, I hope you find this ending and this whole process interesting and entertaining, hopefully. And please pay, make sure you are subscribed. I will make more videos for you on this channel. Actually, today it's coming that CBT transmission, right? So, yeah, thanks for watching. Have a great day.